Hi guys, today I'm going to show you how I created this 90s inspired look. For this one you'll need an assortment of polishes, a thin art brush, and if you have it, some liquid nail tape. Of course the polishes I've used are pictured here and everything will be listed below in the description for you. So we're going to jump in now and create the base for our nail just using some white polish. I'm using my thin art brush and I'm creating this chevron at the base of my nail so it's two lines joined together in the center. And then I'm going to fill in the tip of my nail with that same white polish. And not to worry if you mess up your lines a little bit or get some polish on your skin, I'm going to show you how I clean that up. So I'm just using an art brush with some acetone on it, cleaning up along the edges and cleaning up those initial lines. Now so that I don't have to clean up my skin again, I'm applying some liquid nail tape. I'll include a link below to where I purchased mine. You apply it to your skin and when it dries it turns a darker shade of purple and then you'll be able to just peel that off. So I'll show you that as we move on with this design. So for this part of the design, we're using the dry brush technique. So I'm just using the brush that comes along with my polish and removing as much of the polish as I can from that brush and then just lightly stroking it across the white base. And you'll see it's just leaving behind little kind of scratches of polish. And again, I'm not too worried about getting it on my skin because I have that liquid nail tape there to protect. So I just go through with all my different colors. And now we're ready to add our lines to this design. So for the lines, I'm just using all the same shades of polish I put on the base of my nail, but I've also decided to use a black. And I'm just carefully adding in some straight lines. I'm crisscrossing and changing up the colors. And each of the lines are um, placed differently on my nails so that not all of my nails are uniform. And again, not too worried if I get it on my skin because we're going to clean that up at the end. And you'll see I'm rotating my nail as opposed to always moving the brush and that helps get straighter lines. So once you've added all of your lines, we're ready to remove that liquid nail tape. Now I would normally use my tweezers, but I have no idea where I put them. So I'm just rolling that a little bit until I have a piece that I can grasp with my nails and pulling it off. And you can see there is zero cleanup required. So last but not least, we're going to add our top coat. I'm using my favorite by Rika called Glossy Glam. Apply that to my nail and let everything dry. Guys, if you like this one and recreate it, please hashtag Christabel Nails on Instagram. I'd love seeing your recreations. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to leave some comments below. Thumbs up and new subscribers are always welcome.